Uh, this is Channing Humphrey with Semi Pro Live. I'm here with the victorious South Texas Steelers putting on a show with a last minute win in a thrilling game, six to zero, where they were able to come up with a last minute touchdown. I'm gonna let these young men introduce themselves. It's their second time on our broadcast. My name's Robert Watson. My name's Frankie Sellers. My name's Jane uh, Espinosa. All right, man, you guys were able to hang in there first. I, I gotta start with my big man over here. I love the way your defensive line and your front seven plays football. So, man, what is it about your coaching staff? What do they tell you guys at practice that allows you guys to pursue the ball the way you guys did? Because you guys are out there like some missiles. Coach tells us to watch the ball and do all that kind of stuff. All right, man. So, what was you, now? You were all over the field. You had several plays on offense and defense, and you were in on that game-winning catch, man. Now, in a game that was 0-0, zero to zero, how did you keep it in your mind that you'd be ready when that moment happened at the end of the game where you guys didn't sling the ball around much like you guys do in some of your past games? You know, we just kept moving the ball down the field, and I knew that I could come down with the ball and get the game-winning catch. All right, man. Now, I got one of my other guys. He has a, a new representative of the Breakfast Club. He was outside putting people on the ground, collecting pancakes, doing it on defense, doing it on offense, man. What was it about this week in practice? What did you bring from practice this week out here to the field that allowed you guys to be so successful? Oh, it just tells us to try our hardest to put 110%. All right, now, man, we got to swing over to the kid with the cool hair. We already know his swag was right. When I looked at him on the field, I saw the way he had the socks and the shoes. I knew he was going to come out here and put on a performance. Now, last time I saw you up in Louisville, you swung the ball all around the park. It was a very uh, impressive passing performance. This week, you kind of showed off your running skills, something that we didn't see last time. But you still were able to keep something left in the cannon to get that last minute touchdown throw. So what was it about today's game and, and this week at practice that made you guys so confident in your running game? And how did you stay locked in to still be able to make that big time throw and catch at the end of the game? I actually just push it and uh, play to the fourth quarter. And that's when I went right open. So I just didn't get that now, I'm going to let you guys come in. Before we let you guys go, we're about to run out of time. Do you guys have any final messages for your next round opponent or somebody you guys are going to play in the future? Uh, I just want to say watch out for us. We're coming. All right, man. We'll catch you guys next time after halftime on Semi-Pro Live. All right, man. Great game, y'all. Great lock in. And you're doing some things, man. I'm going to put you together a highlight tape, you dog.